welcome back to my channel. Today is actually going to be a bit different. <laughs> I see my dog is smiling. Um, yeah, today is going to be a bit different. My hair is in a protective style. So it's not really much that I can do or talk about besides all it. And I feel like you guys have seen so many other um, videos with persons doing protective styling and they're just oiling their hair. Yeah, so now my daughter is seven months going to be eight months um on the third of february however she's going through a teething phase right now and with this teething phase it's it came with some rashes and extra dry skin and disclaimer i just want you to know that i am not a pediatrician didn't study any doctor or have a degree in anything biology or nothing like that I'm just a pretty much a mom that are using products that were recommended and the products that I've used with my son because he has very very bad skin um, in terms of eczema um, so I just using the products that works for him and hoping that it works for my daughter so once again disclaimer I am NOT I am NOT listen I I'm not a pediatrician okay and I am not a doctor a general doctor I would say okay I'm just using like I said products that worked for my son and hopefully it works for my daughter excuse our hair another disclaimer today is a Saturday it's a lazy day we're tired I just loosed out her hair so right now um, we're just chilling on the Saturday gonna watch some cartoons and whatnot so let's get back into the you want to say something you want to say something okay so let's get into the products that I'm using um, for her teething obviously it comes with pain and she has been numbing I've been using what they would say um, a, a teething ring however she doesn't like it so I said okay I'll just use my gum I would I clean my hands wash them properly sanitize them and I'll take my finger and then rub it against her gum to do a little massages so to ease the pain and then I would she it came with a fever as well I must say and the fever lasts for about we break it it'll come back so we decided to put her on some cow fall this is it right here cow fall um, it says for two months and up and they and they have the child's age and how much that we should the recommend those that we should give um, the child however with this I found out that the minute we break it it comes right back so I said okay she probably needs something a little bit stronger so I went on to um, a the Panadol, German Panadol now although this says two years and up I gave her it but I gave her in smaller dosage and then when I did this I did this for like about every four I was giving her 2.5 so they said recommend would be like 5 ml uh, but I was giving her 2.5 so I was giving her every four to six hours and I realized that when I gave her it sis was sis was back to normal so yeah I don't know if you can see her skin right now she's pretty much broken out in all of her body she even had a diaper rash with this teething and let me just get a little closer as you can see her skin is not even a camera her skin it's looking better and I'm tell you the product I'm using it's a bit dry now as you can see and then get on her arm and you can see it she has a bit of blockage so some colors coming back to her face she was extremely pink um, the other day the other few days she was extremely pink um, but I said okay I need to moisturize her skin and not sure if this is in the US but this is what I was using it's very popular it's a Banton very popular here in the um, Caribbean I'll mix this because it's actually pretty it's not as strong as the other creams that I've used but it it's very good I would mix it along with this because Sometimes she, she do little she do itch her skin. She do scratch her skin a lot. So I said okay. And it's also it's fragrance free for dry, itchy skin. So this 
worked wonders. As soon as I apply this, sis was not scratching anymore. And I would normally put this on at night, at night time, so I know that she's not trying to eat it or whatnot. Now, in the daytime, this is very popular. I was using this one, Birds and the Bees. So I'm actually going to apply this on right now. And this is actually one of the natural products, and I feel safe that if she was to taste it, I know nothing is going to happen. And if you can see this how it is, this is the consistency of it. So I'm just going to apply this. Really. <laughs> As you can see, she likes to stick her tongue out. <laughs> I'm just going to apply this around just so I could put some moisture in her skin. What I, I realized um, is that her skin is actually a bit drier than my son's skin. And my husband and I, we both have eczema. I have it extremely bad, not as bad as my husband. So we just knew our kids was going to come out with it. So we decided, like, okay, so we got to work on this, like, right now in terms of getting their skin clear, clean, and the best as possible. No, oh, you don't like that? Yeah, so, <laughs> just apply it on her skin right there. So just add a little bit of moisture onto it. And I think, is, I think with this, you have to apply this, I would say, at least two to three times a day when needed, when needed. Um, as best as you can to the affected areas. I'm gonna actually give it a week and see if it makes a difference. Cause they said normally the rashes don't clear until the teeth pops out and so forth. So right now we're on day three. <laughs> day three. <coughs> uh, uh, uh. Uh, yes, yes, yeah. Her gums are really swollen. Like I could see the, the teeth trying to come out, trying to come to head. Yeah. Yeah, so like I said, try these products and see. Um, comment down below and let me know what you guys think or if you've used these products before and how long was the time frame before you actually saw results and Hopefully by next week, her skin should be clear. She was extremely pink for the past two days. And now like some colors coming back into her skin. Thank God for that. I'm excited to see that because she's going to get christened in a few days. Probably. Um, yeah, in a few days. I think Super Bowl is Sunday. If, if her skin is not clear, I'm not, definitely not going to christen her. I'll just give her a few more um, days, weeks, probably her skin to clean up and catch itself. Um, before going to christen her but yeah let me know what you guys think if you guys are using these products how it was affected for you and I'll see you guys in the next video thank you bye bye you want to say bye bye say bye 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 oh no she doesn't want to say goodbye <laughs>